What the fuck? I killed him! You're still not dead. What the fuck? It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. My team is so fucking red! No, God, please, no, no! What's up, guys, and welcome back to another Warzone video. In today's video, I'm gonna showcase how I found this new bed out of hell blueprint, and as you see, it looks pretty awesome with all the beds on it. I will also give you some tips in how to increase the chance by finding the contraband contract and how you can complete them easily. But before we go more in depth, please support the channel by dropping a like and subscribe if you're new here because that would help the channel to grow. First of all, if you want to do the contraband, you will need to complete another contract first, like the scavenger, bounty or recon. Or you will need to find it randomly on the map because somebody else may drop it because he got killed. But everybody knows that finding the contraband contract is based on luck and pretty rare. But you can increase the chance by finding it if you do multiple tasks in a game and also if you do this with a squad of 3 or 4. Because imagine how fast all the contracts will go, because you're doing it with multiple people at once, so the chance by finding the contract will also increase. So try to play a game with more than one people. If you need people to play with, then you can also join my discord, the link is in the description, where we have about 30 people that help each other with stuff like these contracts or easter eggs. Because the more contracts you complete in a game, the higher the chance is that you will find one of the total 4 contrabands. So try to start a battle royale with 2 or 3 other people and start doing a scavenger and once you're done with that, do a reckon and once that's also completed, do a bounty. If you still didn't find the contraband after all this, then do it all over again and start again with the scavenger, then the reckon and as last the bounty. Also make sure to check out your map constantly because somebody may drop the contract and then you need to make sure to pick it up fast as possible because most likely more people are gonna go there too. Ok now imagine you have found it and you need to finish the contraband. First of all make sure to go there as soon as possible before your time runs out because you only have 4 minutes to go to the drop zone and call in the helicopter. Once you're there, call in the helicopter by throwing down a red flare and then try to hide somewhere because always remember that once the helicopter comes it makes a lot of noise and everybody will see it on the map. So now everybody knows that you're doing the contraband and will most likely come there to try to kill you and steal the contraband. So try to hide somewhere safe until the helicopter is there and once the helicopter arrived wait just a few seconds more until he dropped the bag so you can sprint to it and deposit the contraband. And there you go, because once you have done that, you will get the new blueprint, bed out of hell and the amount of cash as you see. So that's basically it for this video. Just make sure to follow these steps because always remember that the chance by finding the contraband is pretty rare. And there comes also luck with it. So make sure to do it with a few friends to increase the chance by finding it. And make sure to do a lot of different contracts. Start with the scavenger, then a reckon and as last the bounty. And all over again if you still haven't found it. If you need help with the contraband then I'm glad to help you out or other people in my discord. So once again make sure to join my discord. So we can do it together or you can drop your Activision name in the comments down below so that you guys can help each other out through the comments. If this video helped you out or you just enjoyed watching it then like always make sure to drop a like. And if you still aren't subscribed until now then make sure to subscribe. And also don't forget to comment down below if you got any further questions because I'm always here to help you out. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in my next video.